We've got to retake the bridge. We can't let Raptor control the ship. No, we need an innocent. A dragon can only be reasoned with by one who is innocent of soul. That lets us out. <laughs> oh, with this equipment, I can jam every communications net on Earth. Imagine world to world Raptor. Defeat the evil one, Lord Raptor. I shall recover the Grail. Uh, yeah, right. By the beard of Bedivere, this could take a bit of searching. Raptor is now alone on the bridge. Excellent! We are on our way! And where, if I may ask, is the dragon? He is in Pyron's collection bay. Isn't the collection bay on the other side of this hatch? Surrender, you doers of evil! That self-righteous beast is getting on me nerves! Come! There's another way to regain control of the ship! People, get ready! It's time for the wide world of Raptor! <laughs> my name is Raptor, and showbiz is my game! I strut my stuff, and say you know my name! Help! Charm! Lifeguard! Never fear, I'm a pro! I know my job! And it's to party hardy, dudes! Here! This bypass should give us remote control of the beamer. Then we'll beam aboard an innocent. What is that Philistine Pyron doing? Chiron has achieved beamer override. Video signal now jammed. Jammed? Oh, the nerve. No one preempts Raptor. No one! Nice shot. That was the helm control. Oh! Computer! Emergency helm override! About time. Initiating helm override. No way, babe! I'm making a withdrawal from your memory banks. Warning. Main logic damaged. Main memory damaged. Main, main... Oh, a tree by a river. A little tom tit sang. Willow tit willow tit willow. Somebody needs to go on a diet. Look, I did it. Our innocent. Felicia? She's no innocent. Not her, you typo twit. Him. You leave Harry alone. Sheathe your claws, Catwoman. Our war can wait. I call a truce. Okay, Pyron. What's the deal? Well, one of these will unjam my video signal. The only way to the bridge is past the dragon. Why should we help the dragon? Raptor tricked him into attacking the Squatches. Besides, wouldn't it be better to have him on our side? Oh, I wonder what this one does. And I said to him, Dickie Bird, why do you sit singing Willow? Tip Willow. Auto destruct sequence engaged. Main engine detonation in 10 minutes. Can you stop it? Only from the bridge. Raptor, you've got to let me on the bridge. The auto destruct will explode the ship like a miniature sun. <laughs> oh, man, what a light show! What an exit! <laughs> what do I care? I'm already dead. Oh, he's hopeless. We're doomed. Not just us. The explosion will flatten everything for thousands of miles. And that includes New York City. Unless... Grant, you're one of those little evil fellows from the glacier. I'm sorry, but doom is your destiny. Wait! I'm not evil! I'm hot, I'm heavy, and I'm exploding your way! Auto-destruct in four minutes. So you see, Raptor tricked you. Well, it's true that I haven't found the Grail, and it was a very brave act to face me alone. You may go. But as I can't tell which of the others are truly evil, uh, they must stay aboard. But the ship's gonna blow up. Sorry, but there you are. You're not a good guy. A good guy wouldn't hurt innocent people. I won't go without Felicia.
King Arthur wouldn't hurt innocent people. Merlin wouldn't either. What do you know of Merlin? He's my ancestor. My Jove, you are! Your courage, your conviction! My dear sir, it is an honor to be on your side. Auto-destruct in one minute. A major mistake, a major malfunction! And I do believe we're on the eve of destruction! Why did you ruin my exit? No! The manual override is disabled! Wait! The main power coupling! It feeds into the backup memory! If I can... Power disengaged. Initiating system restart. Auto-destruct cancelled. <sighs> Raptor, you have lied about honor! You have lied about the Grail! It is time for a reckoning! Hey, uh, look guys, uh, let's be real! Uh, we can talk about this, right? My people to your people? The only people you're going to meet are the ones that will try to piece you back together! Oh, worse life but an entrance and an exit! They've escaped! That sounds like a cue to me. You have my thanks, Felicia. But be warned, when we meet again... I know. Business as usual. Look! They've transported to... <laughs> Hollywood! Splendid! I know how to fix our friend! A spell? No. A phone call. Cut! Print it! Great, Mel. Bring in a stunt double. Action! Raptor, babe, sweetheart. I think I can get you off this picture. Stunts, we're ready for you. And give up, showbiz? Never. It's the best car in the lot. No, so I don't want that. What's going on over there? That's Freak. And she's going to be selling her some car insurance today. <laughs> You'll buy our insurance, or you won't get the car! What's that? It must be Eagle Man! I've got something for you! You can't beat these! Eagle quotes the law! So don't buy your from a freak dealer. We're back, paisanos. Did you see that someone is playing a practical joke on us? Huh? I mean, sending us over tons of pizzas that we don't want. You're right. Will you stop it with the eating already? Ma, huh, what's the matter with you? What happens when the bill comes from the pizzeria? Huh? Do you realize that we cut all our fortune here? Now, you listen to me. I don't want you to take one more picture from that girl. Cabbage! Oh, humana, 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 humana. Surprise, surprise! Here you go, Mario. Oh, thanks. You're welcome, Mario, my darling. <laughs> I shall return. Oh, I wish I was a plumber. <laughs> what? Uh, Mario, my darling. I'm your brother. I keep talking to you. Talking to you is like talking to a wall. I say, yeah, you keep going. You don't care about nothing. It's amazing to me. You okay in there? Yeah. All right. All right. Come on. Watch how you walk and be careful, huh? And hurry up. You got a lot. You all right, Mario? I can handle this. Oh. How many times I got to tell you? Meet Miss Cowns. It was an accident. It's an accident. It's always an accident. I love you. You're my brother. But I, I tell you once, I tell you twice. It's like you don't listen. Why is that? Why won't you believe a babe like Jody? I mean, she, she thinks I'm cute. What? 
She thinks you're cute. I think you're cute, too. What's hard to believe is who's going to pay for this pizza she keeps delivering, huh? What are you going to do about that, Mr. Cutesy Wootsy Pootsy Tootsy? Don't worry about it. I got a plan. You got a plan. I got to figure kind of it out. I got a plan. Watch. I'm watching. I'm watching. Yum, yum, yum. Here you go, Mario. Oh, thanks, Jody. I, I, I got a, a, a brother got a question. Well, my brother wants to know why, why you keep bringing me all these pizzas. Oh, well, you might not have noticed this, Mario, but I think you're awfully cute. Poor kid, she couldn't help herself. She thinks I'm cute. Yeah, 400 pounds are cute. Look, miss, I have a question. Who's going to pay for all these pizzas? Oh, no one. They're free. Free? Yeah, the, the pizzeria hired a new chef, and he's been experimenting with all kinds of weird ingredients. And the boss said to throw them out, but I thought it'd be a great excuse to see Mario, and well, he'll eat anything. And, oh, I gotta run. Bye. Oh, bye. Bye. You want a piece of peppermint pizza? Forget about the peppermint pizza. Find out if she's got a sister that delivers. Girl. Hey. Till next time, everybody!